Welcome in all my friends, Lazy Retired Granny here. Today is Tuesday, March 5th, 2024. The time is 6.11 a.m. here in Still Dark and about 40 degrees Salem, Oregon. I am continuing my journey on panel three of five of the canvas that you guys picked out for me to do. Can't really see too much here. I think I'm not even for sure what part this is. I think we got some houses over here and this is just a bunch of the background. Anyway, I'm working sideways. Hopefully I can do this. So I got my Breakfast blend coffee with Prince Vanilla Creamer. And I also um, have under the warmer, once again, the fresh baked sugar cookies. Wax melts. Oh, they smell so good. Yeah. I got to put a spot of hand lotion on. Yeah, my hands are dry. Old lady hands. And they're kind of beat up this morning because it is March 5th and the 5th of each month, Ellie gets her trifexis um, flea meds. She's only got, I think, two or three left of the Trifexis. Then she starts the new medicine, which is a different brand. Um, but at Trifexis, oh, it's just a nightmare trying to give it to her. And they're big horse pills. And she does not like it. I cannot disguise it. Nothing. And so I have to take the pill, open up her mouth with those massive teeth um, <laughs> that are sharp and yeah and just gently put it down her throat yeah and today she was not having it at all and so yeah it took a few tries to to get that in and she knew she knew that she was going to have it today i don't know how she knows but she knows crazy dog so let me get this out and i'm going to do the l's because i can see them real good sideways and that's number four which is two two five and 225 is Ultra Very Light Shell Pink. And I have quite a few of them, so I'm going to shake a bunch in here. I am really hoping that I can be ambitious today and complete this. And then I will have the March panel done. And then I'm gonna start on my monthly grab bag. And yeah. Then I can start on my Chuck Pinson. For the rest of the month. And I don't have to worry about these. Not that I would worry, but you know what I mean. Jelly bean. So yeah, it is a little on the cool side. This morning it was really cold. Um, it was cold in 
in here. I did turn the heat on for a little bit just to get the icicles melted. And it should stay comfortable now for the rest of the day. And hopefully, it's only supposed to be 45 today. But no snow. We're not in the snow zone. Yesterday, it was cold. We don't have wind like we did yesterday, but a breeze. It really wasn't a wind, but... <clears throat> it did drop the temperatures down a few degrees. And it did rain off and on. Not really, you know, a downpour, just rain on and off. So, yeah, in between the raining, I went out and got my pooper scooping done. And, yeah, I didn't do a lot of diamond painting yesterday. I just kind of off and on a little bit. I did some knitting. Watched some TV. I watched... A, um, Martin Clunes again. I'm still trying to get through it. And it's a kind of a documentary. He's visiting different islands in Great Britain. Yeah, and I'm really enjoying it. Some of it, it's like, oh my gosh, I can't believe you're doing that. Oh my gosh, that's scary. Uh, when he's going to visit these islands and <clears throat> but it's it's interesting not something I would go do in some of those remote islands Plus, I'm not a water person. And while I was watching them in the boats and, and stuff, it's like, oh my gosh. I wonder if a big whale came up and overturned you. Or <laughs> That's what I'm afraid of. Yeah, I am deathly scared of the water. So I don't think I'll be going on any cruises. <laughs> Let's see, what else did I do yesterday? Anything exciting? I don't think so. I was pretty lazy yesterday. <clears throat> to think if anything happened. Um, what else did I watch on TV? So I watched that and then I watched I can't remember if that was yesterday. I think it was. I watched the next episode on Acorn TV of um, Murnock Mysteries and 
don't know if it was yesterday or the day before, Martin Clunes also had a documentary on there that I watched. And the latest episode of hmm, another show I can't remember the name of. So I got through all that, so I'm all caught up with stuff over there on that streaming service. BritBox has some shows that I'd like to see, so I may have to subscribe to that for a month. Because I can get through all the shows in a month and then cancel the subscription. They have some shows over there that I like that I can't watch anywhere else. So. But usually when I do that, <clears throat> when I subscribe to a streaming service, it's like when I know I'm going to have the time to go in and watch what I want, and then cancel it because for me it's kind of not cost effective for me to keep a streaming service that I don't watch a lot of. My son and I, we share a couple streaming services. Um, we have Paramount Plus and Netflix. Hmm. And of course, I have Acorn TV. And what else do we have? Oh, and of course, um, Amazon Prime or whatever it's called. I don't even know what it's called. I don't understand all these names that, different names for different, same thing, but. But that's more than enough for me. And I like to watch the... For American TV, I usually watch the older shows. From the 70s. I like those. Maybe into the 80s. But not much. Truthfully, but and I like British shows. That's my favorite. Their actors seem more down to earth than actors here. I'm still eating on my stew. <laughs> I just have not been real hungry. So. Or else that stew is just filling me up, up at lunchtime. And. I did yesterday finish up my cookies from Subway. I don't know how I resisted and they lasted as long as what they did, but oh, they were 
good. And then Becky said that she got one of those um, pretzels, foot long pretzels, and it comes with cheese. So, yeah, I'm going to have to check that out because. Yeah, that sounds good to me. I know at Little Caesars, if you get their breadsticks, it used to come with sauce. Now you have to pay an extra... 89 cents for a thing of sauce and yeah at least the little Caesars I go to you used to get that free Yeah, my, I got my printer to work, so I printed off that coffee time. Um, anyway, I printed off that pattern that Ross shared. So now I think I've got three or four new patterns, so got to get busy and finish that project I'm on. But I got a ways to go on it. I'm not even halfway done yet. I think it's because I've been spending more time this last month on uh, diamond painting. I still haven't started my journal. I said I was going to do that March 1st and I still haven't got it started. And I have everything for it. Oh, but I don't know what's wrong with me. And I just don't understand because I'm excited to do it. just don't know why that is one that um, I'm procrastinating on. Crazy. These drills are sure eating up my wax. Maybe I need a... a new tip. I don't think so, though. But maybe. It seems to me that The squares use more wax? I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe I'm just making that up. Fake news. I'm going to have to wipe these off because I'm getting 
wax stuck on them. Ellie's mad at me right now, so she probably won't come over and give you a secret message. I like to give her her medicine right after she eats, you know, in a full belly. Yeah, I gotta make her appointment for her um, six month comprehensive exam. <clears throat> And I think she needs her immunizations this time. Not for sure what she needs. I'll have to look at her chart online. remember if she goes in April or May. Her birthday's in May, May 2nd. She'll be 10 years old. She's catching up with me now. We'll be the same age. Let's do the check marks because I can see those pretty good. And that is color 3865. Which is winter white. So anyway, today I'm having another bowl of stew. Probably last me till at least tomorrow, unless I get super hungry and need two bowls. One for lunch and one for dinner. But yeah, it's filling me up. But I have been doing so many squares lately. I think my monthly grab bag though is round. And I'm sure the pension is square. Let me look. Yep, it is. <laughs> I bought that painting well I got it from Hobby Lobby when they had their um, clearance sale last year Let me look when I bought that. that was oh my gosh okay that was back Anticipation of the day ahead. When did I buy that? Hmm. Oh, here it is. Oh, no. That one I got 
from Amazon. I doing all right I think I'll do hmm, I think I'll do the sevens because I can see those really good and that's two 168 very light pewter And that canvas that I bought from Dreamer Design that was sold out, the palace. Yeah, as, as soon as I got that notification that it was back in stock, I bought it. And it was sold out practically immediately. Yeah, that's, I didn't realize that was going to be such a popular canvas. Of course, you don't know how many they get in at a time. I mean, if they only get 10 in, <laughs> I don't know how all that works. Yeah, I've got some, a couple from Dreamer that i am uh, got my eye on. And depending on what they put out for new and returning, I don't, I have a few that are sold out that's on my heart list but you know they were new and sold out immediately well you got to be quick on the draw you can't you know be contemplating <laughs> and stuff boy it just Things sell out so fast. Oh, there's a dog hair. Oh, what did I do with my tweezers? Where'd I put them? There they are. I still have to find the cap to this because I don't want to be stabbed by them again. Once was enough. So I have them. Face down in my little container here. All right, let's look for sevens. I think I got them all. Okay, I can probably do this color. Oh, it was stuck to my pen. Want to make sure that that didn't fall off. Okay, so I think well, actually, actually, I think I can do the M's five. Ooh, don't have very many of those left. I'm gonna have to open up uh, another bag of those. Those are three tens. that 
aside and look in my yeah I've still got two bags so let's go ahead and get that taken care of They fit right in there perfect. But I'm just going to put the last of these in there. And we're off and rolling again. And these are M's. Okay. So it's hard to find the M's here. Whoops, I guess it would ha help if I had a drill on there, huh? These aren't the best three tens, <laughs> but that's okay. They're kind of scattered all over down here, but there are a lot of them up there. I think we're doing the palm tree or whatever tree that is. Yeah, I'm anxious to get on my grab bag one. I really like Tiny Fun. Um, Becky is doing a grab bag of Tiny Fun too. She posted A whip and chat um, showing her progress so she's probably done with it now she only needed a few more drills in it so and then she said she's gonna go back and start again on um, I can't think of the name of it the uh, canvas that I just completed I'm going to have to flip this over to do that side. There we go. That'll make it a little easier. Nothing on the agenda today, really. I really see something outside, I guess. You had to go. Take a look out the door.
Maybe she's not mad at me anymore. Oh, there she is. She's not mad at me anymore. <laughs> Ellie, you're so funny. Oh, she must think I still have more medicine for her, but I don't. There are three tens in this. Which is probably good because then that'll make it easier to see the other ones. Hasn't been much on YouTube for me to watch. I don't know what's going on. Everybody is silent. I watched. Where's my mouse? Okay. I watched London City Walks, of course. Um, did he post a part two yet? Nope. Um, I don't know what's going on over there. It's been kind of slow, too. But I'm still making my way through some of his longer ones that he did last year, about a year ago. So I can watch that. And Ross, I watched him. He... Just did a little short update on what he's doing. It was less than 10 minutes. And uh, Mike did a little short video on his stickers. And I watched one of, um, I can never remember. I know part of her name, but it's so long I forget. Um, Bella is a Morky, her life and mine. <laughs> yeah, I watched one of hers. Yeah, and... I guess I could stream if I got real desperate. If I'm watching something I've seen before, I can stream it on my Chromebook, but... Yeah, I'm boring today, aren't I? Nothing's been going on. It's just been really lazy. I'm trying to think if anything happened yesterday. My son and daughter-in-law rearranged their house. I went up yesterday morning and took a look at that. And their <clears throat> kitchen, family room, dining room, it's all a huge, huge room. And um, they moved their... 
I don't know how to say this, but anyway, they're making it their main room now rather than have a living room. And so they move furniture and blah, blah, all that stuff. And oh my, I really like it. They got their TV in there and comfy couches and yeah, it's really nice. So they like to eat on TV trays in front of the TV and now they can do that in that room because it's, you know, the kitchen is, it's in one area. They got a pretty big area. That's where I filmed last summer when I was taking care of Negan when they were gone. Yeah, that was nice. Tons of room to lay out canvases and all that. Yeah, I would like that room. It is huge. And then their living room, which um, there's a fireplace in there and um, beam ceilings and huge, huge windows and, you know, the ceiling to floor windows. And uh, they made that into their kind of entertainment room, I would say. Yeah, they have it fixed up really nice. So, they're still working on it. They're not done yet. Yeah, they're doing... They've got a talent for doing stuff like that. But one of their couches, they wanted to know if I wanted it. And so I went up to measure to see if I wanted it or not. But no, it's more like a love seat. That would not be big enough for Ellie and me. I need to find where that squeak is on my couch. My couch has recliners at each end. And the one end where Ellie usually sits has a squeak and every time she moves it squeaks and I just don't like that sound I can't find out where the squeak is coming from Ugh, boy, yeah, lots of three tens. Well, how long have I been on here? 44 minutes. <laughs> okay, I'm going to let you go. I really don't have anything I don't think to talk about. Yeah, it's looking gray out there today. I don't know if that's because we're going to have a gray day or what's going on. Hey, Google, is it going to rain today? Probably not. Today in Salem, there's only a low chance of rain. Okay, well, maybe it's fog coming in because it's really looking gloomy out there. Cause it's 
Well, true, it's only 7 o'clock. It's going on 7 o'clock, so I don't think the sun's going to be out. Alrighty, I'm going to let you go rather than me rattle on over nothing and the weather. So, um, I hope you all have a wonderful day today. And I do appreciate everybody who stops by and visits and comments. And, oh, I forgot the comments today. Oh, my goodness gracious. Well, you know, I'm answering them. So, um, but I do appreciate everybody for stopping by. And I will chat with you later. And my button... Why isn't it moving? There it is. Oh, there's a secret message from Ellie. Okay, chat with you later.